Staying in South Africa with the public transport system in Cape Town, plans on going high-tech. A fleet of new electric buses are scheduled to enter into service in the not-too-distant future. The vehicles will be utilised on the My City bus rapid transport system, which currently uses a large and relatively costly fleet of diesel-powered buses. This is part of the city's broader set of initiatives to make it Africa's greenest city. CGTN's Travis Andrews filed this report. The days of these gas guzzlers may be coming to an end. The city plans to start using electric buses, the first of which are expected to enter into service fairly soon. It's part of the city's attempts at a multi-level fiscal and environmental approach to public transport. It wants to cut its greenhouse gas emissions and costs as well. The um, operational costs of diesel buses is unpredictable because the fuel price is unpredictable. Um, and so we're looking, we're looking for a more predictable and a more stable um, operational cost for our fleet. Um, and then the buses are far more comfortable for commuters. They're quiet, they have no vibration, so it's a much more comfortable ride. So it is the future um, of, of mobility in the world. The electric buses will operate on the various routes of the My City Bus Rapid Transport System, which shuttles thousands of commuters to and from the city every day. The city plans on saving on both fuel and servicing costs, with photovoltaic panels expected to charge the battery system. The buses will also be tested for operational efficiency. We have acquired 11 buses. We want to test them to see what their operational um, performance is like, and then we can make a choice as we expand the My City fleet as to whether we use electric buses or diesel buses or a, a mixture of, of the two in um, the fleet expansion. The buses have been procured, fully tested and are ready to roll and are at an advanced stage of final delivery, albeit with a few last-minute administrative hurdles. Electric buses may be good for the environment, but some commuters are hoping it will also be good for their pockets. Obviously, a lot of people want uh, transport fares to go down and that's something that could also work for the poor and it could save us time and money so i'm really up for it and i think everyone wants it as well yeah it, i think it will to help in a way because obviously now prices are going up every month and now we're expecting a raise on taxes and buses as well so maybe to help us in a big, uh, big 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 way so it seems the days of these loud polluters of the public transport system are numbered and Cape Town will be entering a new period of not only more environmentally friendly travel, but possibly a cheaper way as well. Travis Andrews, CGTN, Cape Town.